Hello and welcome back to this Persona 4 Golden Let's Play with me, SLJ RPG. In the last episode, we went to the beach for the first time. Kanji got himself in a little bother with his underwear, but we generally had a nice little bonding experience with the team. Uh, and then in this episode, we've got a whole bunch of stuff we're going to do. We've got to buy some books first and foremost, so let's make our way to the bookstore. Still annoyed about the favourable dishes not being available to us, but. What can you do, ladies and gentlemen? What can you do? Not much, apart from go back, and I'm unwilling to do that. <laughs> um, so, let's make our way to the central shopping district. It's being a bit weird for some reason, and I do not know why, guys. But we're here. I am going to get this thing sorted. I'll see you guys in a second. Oh, it's back and it seems to be working. Right, we need to do some book working. We're going to buy Man God, and we're also going to buy Food Fight. Because, of course, we are the book man. And today, we're actually... We've got so much yen, look how much yen we've got. We're actually going to be spending our time with... You're late. Before you look for my memory, here's some place I want to go. I want to liven things up, if that's okay. We want to go, we have the A on Persona. Let's spend the day Let's with go. Marie. She looks happy. It's unusual. <laughs> alright, alright. Take me out. Just decided to take Marie out. She's so this, yeah. Marie's insistence you have come at these stakes yours. If it isn't you, Kun and Maria Chan, we we meet again. Yo. Senpai, what you doing here? Oh. No fair, you all here without me. You could have called, you know. Everyone seems to have gathered around. You spent a fun time with everyone, including Marie. They all seem to like uh, Marie. See ya. It's going late, so you leave everyone and scold Marie back to the velvet room. I don't get why we just haven't told them about the Velvet Room yet, but that's fine. Of course, last episode we agreed to help Nanako with her homework, so we decided to look over her homework. I have written three proverbs for my homework today. Oh, I know one. It's um, a rolling stone gathers no moss. Dad always used to tell me that one. Who can that be? Your scan Teddy came by. We had a little event going at June Estate. Here's a souvenir for you, Nanako chan. Oh, you're doing summer homework? I feel sorry for you. Ooh, I'll help you, Nana-chan. <laughs> Proverbs. Ooh, uh, I have one. Galkado ergo sum. <sighs> Where did you pick that up? Don't cast pearls before swine. It's more like something you'd say. Yosuke and Teddy helped Nanako finish her homework. We became closer to everyone. Apart from, Te apart from Teddy, apparently. You feel like your relationship with Yosuke is going to come close soon, and Nanako as well. After putting Nanako to bed and saying goodbye to Teddy and Yosuke, you went to your room. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. This is what we're going to be doing. Summer break will be over soon. You've got homework left to do. What's there to do today? We're going to go eat at the Chinese diner. It's definitely what we're going to do. So, this time, we need understanding. We need knowledge and we need diligence once again. So, of course, you know the kind of deal by now. We need to go into town. Head into the central shopping district. And get to that Chinese diner. We've also got a... We've also got to... It's a doing it again! How very annoying. I'm sorry guys if it is lagging for you. But I cannot afford more expensive shit. But that's fine. We're going to save. And then I'll see you guys at the Chinese diner once that is complete. So yeah, understanding... 
knowledge and diligence. So here we are. We've accepted a challenge. Let's see what it is. Can't see the rice. We're getting pulled into a meat dimension as always. So, understanding, knowledge, diligence. Seems to be the one that we mostly get when we're unranking this up. So, understanding has increased. We go from generous to motherly. Knowledge has increased. Diligence has increased. Woo, I love it. When it does the first time. Ah, too bad, mister. That'll be 3,000 yen. Come back soon. After finishing meal, you went home. We are, of course. Looking over Nanako's homework. I've written an essay about something I remember. Hmm. Is someone here today, too? She and Yukike came by. I heard you escape that Nanako-chan is doing her homework. I'm here to help you. You're writing an essay? Have you decided on what topic, Nanako? Not yet? Well, let's see. How about the time we went to the festival together? That's right. Iyaka was so good and I had so much fun. Nanako begins writing her essay. Chie and Yuko help with Nanako's essay. Everyone became closer. Your relationship with Chie is going to become closer soon. You feel like your relationship with Nanako is going to become closer soon. Our relationship with Yuko can't become closer soon. <laughs> But it's there just in case. Summer break will be over soon. Is there something you've got some homework left. Is there something what's there to do today? Not that shit. Oh hello? It's me, Chie. Do you mind hanging out with me today? I'll pass. Oh. I'll see you later. Chie hung up. We're instead gonna be hanging out with Rise. So, let us Go outside. We should be going out to the evening. And we've of course already got um We've already got the persona of the Lovers Arcana, which is important. So let's go see what Risa Chan is doing. Oh Senpai. If you're free, let's go play. We have Lean and Sidibe. Should we spend a day with Risei? Where should we go? She looks happy. Central Shopping District. We walked home with Risei after a trip to Okinawa City. <laughs> I place loads of special orders. Come with me next time I pick them up, Senpai. I had tons of fun today. The many people try to come and talk. Maybe they already forgot who I am. Oh yeah, you want to take some tofu home? I helped them make them today. Wait right here. Excuse me, you said, is it? Sorry about the other day. I'm Minoru Ino, Risa Kajaya's former manager. I'm sorry to bother you, but could you give this to her? He handed you a letter. La Fanet, you see. Does she even need them? You may be right, but Risa always did forward this did look forward to this girl's letters. In today's cult of personality, being a popular carries its own problems. Your schedule fits together, minute by minute, like a jigsaw. Every day, you're squeezing utterly dry. But even knowing that, I still want her to come back. She's genuinely brilliant. Not only that, but she's strong enough to use that pain as a foundation. From what I can see, she's relying on you. So could you? Sorry, Senpai, we're all sold out. Ino was sound. Quit pestering me! What did you say to Senpai? I'm sorry, I'm leaving you now. Goodbye. Hounding me after I quit. He's practically a stalker. To think I trust him, I feel betrayed. He's worried about you. No. He just wants Reset back. The me he created. Reset is biting her lip. So, what did he come for? You told us him why he came and handed her the fan letter. Oh. This letter? She wrote again. But he came all the way here just for this. This girl is a middle school student. She writes to me all the time. Did this public service campaign to stamp out bullying? She didn't inspire her. She wrote that she wouldn't let buddies get her down. That she was trying to make friends. Ever since then, she wrote me letters. To this, today, this happened to me. I was able to say this. Stuff like that. Seeing Rosette work hard encourages me. <laughs> it makes me feel like I can still hang in there. I, does she really know how it works? Huh? 
But still, every time I read the letters, I feel like Rosette actually meant something. Whenever things get done, I would read them over and over. Do you still have some free time? Tessia Strine. Rise seems to be deep in thought after reading the fan letter. Mm. She's worried about me. Officially, I'm taking a break due to illness, so... Before I quit, there was talk about a part in a movie. Seems like she was really looking forward to it. Please get well soon and come back, she says. I'm so glad you were here. I was scared to read alone. I gave up on being reset. I can't meet her expectations. Hmm. We are unable to pick this because we don't have enough understanding. So, we have to say, having second thoughts. I have no regrets. At least I think not. I mean, it was such a relief to quit, to go back to the be the real me. <laughs> Rise has a lonely smile on her face. Anyway, Reset doesn't exist anymore. It's not this girl I just pointed in the I just pointed lots of other people. The president of the company told me over and over. I knew already. I knew this was the path I chose, but... <laughs> Maybe I'll inherit the tofu shop. I'm the shop's main attraction now. I bet it could thrive. Senpai? Maybe you should really just do it, you know, what I was saying a while back. You could marry me once we graduate hi high school, and then two of us could work at the tofu shop together. Sounds like fun. How about it? If you're serious. If I'm serious? I think I'm pretty serious. You're always so calm, <laughs> but I like that. She's smiling sheepishly. Thank you, Senpai, for being with me all of today. I feel better. I'm fine. I can contribute something. It looks like there's still plenty of things I can do. You can sense Rise's quiet will. You feel like you understand her even more. As we get a rank up to level 6. Which is very, very good. Social link 7, 6. Powers to create the personas of the lovers of Connor has grown. Rise's determination battle has been enhanced even further. She will now precisely identify enemies' weaknesses. She will inform us, which is very, very good. Sorry for dragging you around all day. I'll let you go now. I'll see you later, Senpai. He walked Rise to her house and went home. We started to look over Nanako's homework. For today's homework, I have to write a book report. I already finished reading the book, so I just need to write about it. A king goes deep into the forest and... Nanako puts lots of effort into a book report. He was all alone, so he wasn't angry or sad. The king said he was happy, but I feel sad for him. Big bro, do you feel happy when you're alone? No. Oh good, neither do I. <laughs> Nanako seems happy. And that's what we want. After finishing our report, you decide to put her back to bed and return to her room. Some break will be over soon. You still have homework left to do. But we don't need to do it right now, do we? It's rainy! So we need to go eat some mega beef bowl. Of course. The only option. So let's go outside. We certainly shall be going out till the evening. Going to town? We certainly will be. We all know where we're going. Let's head to... The Central Shopping District. And of course, we'll be looking for a certain upgrade this time, and we're looking for understanding, knowledge, and diligence. That seems to be the most common, but hopefully we get it first time here. So let's do this. So, let's hope it's now understanding 
We cannot finish it still. We will get there one day. Best try to finish well. Understanding has increased. Knowledge has increased. Courage. So I'll see you guys once we've done it. We got it, guys. Understanding, knowledge, diligence. Too bad, mister. That'll be 3,000 yen. Come back soon. We're going to be able to finish it one day. After finishing a meal, you went on home. We're on that path. As we're helping Nanako with our homework, decide to look over Nanako's homework. I'm doing my art homework today. I have to make something out of stuff I find in the house. A milk carton, paper towel tube, knitting wool, origami paper. What else do we have? Is something, someone here today too? Risa and Kanji came by. Senpai said that Nanako Chan was doing a summer homework. You should have told me. But it looks like I picked the wrong day to come. I can't do anything of this art stuff. Me neither. Let me see what you got. Kanji carefully crafts something with incredible detail. Create something that no elementary student could make. You became closer to everyone. You feel like your relationship with Kanji is going to become close soon. And Rise and Nanako-chan. After putting Nanako to bed, saying goodbye to Rise and Kanji, you went to your room. And I think we've seen all of the crew come and help. Some break will be over soon. There's still some left to do. What would you do today? So, Hello. we are passing for now, maybe some other time, in the next episode, but we're going to buy something from here first. Let's watch the shopping channel. You've ordered from the show has arrived, it's the Genji Beta Combo, la 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 la. And then what we need to buy here is the next one, Thief Dagger Combo, this is what we're going to be going for. We turned off the TV, and I think if you've enjoyed this episode, please like and subscribe, and I will see you next time when we eventually get to doing our own homework. Peace.